couple of friends, she was gorgeous. I don't know how you, my cousin Mario was a like ugly man, and you used to always get all these beautiful women. And she fell off her bike, and she was only in a wee skirt and crane, and her knees and that looked like peaches. I always remember when I was young. Thanks, Gio. Yeah, it's scary, Andrew. What are we strong? Too strong for you. Oh, Sarah, by the way, that can be really scary. I know what it's like, and especially in, in Australia, we've got really can heavy waves. And I remember going on a fucking date with this Australian guy, and he took me to Burley, and it's got really heavy waves there, and it was not sexy. I was getting, like, hit by one wave, and then I got up, and then it was like, it, it, it's actually really scary, and it can be really dangerous. I'm glad you're okay. Stuart, my advice on Thailand, I would get, if you're doing any tours, I would do booking all your tours online. Make sure you don't book any through these people that are uh, like just standing in the street because they'll fucking scam you. Um, so if you do it online, you know that you're not, you've got, you know, some cover. Um, if you also, I would um, think about downloading the Grab app, which is good for, like, it's like our equivalent to um, Uber, really, because it does food and it does, like, um, taxis and you won't get fucking ripped off by people in the street for the taxis. And um, what else would I recommend? Obviously, I would look into, obviously, scams there, but, like, then again, if you do any tours or anything like that and you're doing it online, you shouldn't be getting scammed. So, that's also one thing to look out for. And, oh, man, don't smoke loads of weed because I've done it and it's too much. <laughs> um, I don't know what else could I recommend to you. I never went to Pattaya, that's one place that I missed and I wish I went. I still want to go back to Thailand, but and go to, I never went to Chai Mai either, which I would recommend. I would recommend to go to Chai Mai, you can do this like an overnight bus, which is really cool. Um, and it takes you up to Chai Mai and you could even go up there for a couple of days. It's meant to be really beautiful and um, do what I didn't do. Nah, Sarah, that's nothing to be embarrassed about. It, I, I know a person that, um, he was a young, well, I don't know the guy, but I know a girl that was on this, um, uh, she was on a scuba diving course with these, with, down at the, at the, up at the barrier reef in, in Cairns, and he was a strong swimmer. He was like a footballer. Um, ages with me, maybe even younger, actually probably younger, because my mate Molly's younger than me, and <clears throat> he died. Um, just out scuba diving and the, the waves caught him and fucking hanged him. It's really, really dangerous. Like, it's nothing to be embarrassed about. Fuck that. Sometimes it hits you. It's scary, actually. I know what it's like when you get hit by a wave and you come up and then one's coming right at you and it really fuck it. they're really fucking strong as well. What's a beautiful landscape, Mike? Any other places that I want to visit and revisit in Thailand? I'd like to go back to Fifi Island. I feel like I didn't really do enough on Fifi Island, but it rained a lot and I had my tattoo, so I couldn't actually go in the water for a few days. I feel like that's affected quite a bit of my holiday because I've been getting all these fucking tattoos and I can't go and do things because I'm having to make my tattoo. Wait for my tattoo to repair. Yeah, I want to go to Ch I'd want to go to Chai Mai. I'd want to go back to Fifi. I'd want to go to Koh Samai because that's I was on Koh Phan Yang and Koh Samai's here and Koh Toa, and they're like, like that like Koh Phan Yang's here and they're the other islands on either side. I would like to go there. Um. Yeah, it is Mike, and. How is your tattoo doing? I'll show you that. Hopefully I'll not get fucking over 18 for showing you that. Wait. Yeah. See if I can. I can't show enough, but you know. It's fucking amazing. It's beautiful. 
The guy's, the guy's unreal, and the, the only reason he became a tattoo artist, it's not like it's been a passion for his for, the, for his whole life, is because of COVID. He was a bellboy and he never had a job because he looked, he worked in a hotel, and he said, oh, "I'll just become a tattoo artist." I thought you're fucking amazing. Like, I, don't get me wrong, this guy was amazing. He was really good, and he was number two in Thailand. But I reckon this guy's better. Oh, it's amazing. Thanks, thanks, Ghosty. Yeah, Mike, and I've still got so much more to show you. I'm trying, I'm just, yeah, today I did spend a lot of time editing all these videos and I'm hopefully going to be caught up by the end of the couple, next couple of days because I'm not doing very much. Um, So I've, sh I've still got more to show you. I don't even know if I showed you. I don't know if I bought tour on Fifi Island and I don't even think I made a fucking vlog about that. So I'm... I feel like it's annoying because it's like nearly two months old, like a month, maybe a month and a half old, but I still want to show you. Thanks, one feather. I went to Thailand and all hopes to do all three islands, drove to Pattaya and go. I never went to Pattaya. What's it like, Ryan? Okay, Mama Bear, have a good day. Kelly! Sorry, I knew you were going to, you told me your name the other day and I, I was trying to remember it. It's Kelly. Yeah, have a good day, Kelly. <laughs> uh, are you back and back up? No, I'm currently in the Philippines now. Um, I came all the way to this island just to see this guy. Uh, my, my German mate had a tattoo by him and I was like, that's amazing, I've never seen anything like it. Well, who is this guy? He's, like, he's on this little island in the middle of the Philippines and it took me like four flights to get here, but totally worth it. Are you going to get some of your legs? Get no, what will happen is I'll get the tattoo, obviously, it comes here. And I'll just get, I'm going to get the geometric, I've got a bit of geometric on the top of it, I'm going to get the geometric on the side of my bum and that's about it. And then I've still got that, it's going to come up from here, like I've got wee birds here and I'm going to make them come up from the from my arm and make some of them red, so like red and black birds and it'll come up and then it'll start into like the flowers and that that he's kind of done there. So it'll all come up to and be like one big tattoo. Um. And then I think I'm going to have a break because I've got no money, guys. I need to stop spending all my money on all this. And I need to go. I'm going on Tuesday to get my wisdom tooth taken out. So I've had all this dental work and all these fucking tattoos. And I said to myself, I was going to Asia to save money. And I have done nothing but spend it. <laughs> Pattaya. What's Pattaya like, Mr. Nice? Um, who wants the Bobby? I'm good. How are you? No, I'm sorry. I was only there for five days.